All right, Sky, show me what you got. Dude, is that Zeus on a lightning cloud? That's so awesome. Man, hopefully he is on his way to the underworld. Time to light up this gloomy party. Hades, you can't hide from me, bro. Let's settle this once and for all. Hope they've got good reception down there. I'm about to make a call that Hades can't ignore. Nice decor, Hades. Really brings out the gloom. Intruder! Lord Hades will be pleased with your soul. Party's here, huh? Let's dance. You'll fall like all the others before Hades might. Come on, Puffs. Don't make me fetch a stick. You think you're strong, god of the sky? The underworld will crush your spirit. Impressive, brother. But you're in my world, now. Show yourself, Hades. <laughs> Or are you too scared to face me? So this is what you've been up to, Hades. Building fan clubs in your honor. This ends now. You'll pay for this, Sky God. Hades' wrath will be upon you. I'm not here to make payments. I'm here to make changes. You can't defeat us all, Zeus. Guess I'll have to prove you wrong. One zap at a time. Your reign of terror is crumbling, Hades. Just like this statue. Zeus, you dare to challenge me in my own domain? I'm not here for a family reunion, Hades. I'm here to end your tyranny. Enough, brothers. This conflict solves nothing and only brings more suffering. Dear Aphrodite, always the peacemaker. But peace is a luxury we can't afford. Zeus, we must find a way to bring lasting peace, not just for us, but for all who dwell in these realms. I know, Aphrodite. But as long as Hades schemes in the shadows, peace will remain a distant dream. We must prepare for what's to come. Keep your guard up. We're not exactly invited guests here. I know, but if Zeus can help us against Hades, it's worth the risk. Welcome, mortals, to my abode. I am Zeus, king of the gods and protector of those who seek my aid. We've come with urgent news. Hades is amassing power on the island, threatening us all. We need your help, Zeus. Your brother's actions could destroy everything we fought for. I am aware of my brother's ambitions. His thirst for control knows no bounds. But know this, I stand with you against the darkness that threatens our world. Thank you, Zeus. We can stop Hades and preserve the balance. Indeed we shall. Let us unite our strengths and bring forth the down free from the shadows of tyranny. Hades seeks not just to rule, but to enslave. His forces, if left unchecked, will bring ruin to all who dwell on this island. 
We won't let that happen. Our resistance force is ready to stand against whatever Hades throws at us. We've faced tough odds before. With your help, Zeus, we can rally our allies and protect our home. We must be cunning and swift. Hades' forces are formidable. But with precise strikes and united effort, we can disrupt his plans and weaken his hold on the island. Together, we embody the strength of mortals and gods. This alliance is our shield against the darkness. Let us stand as a beacon of hope and courage. Let's show Hades that he's underestimated the power of unity. For the island, for our friends, for freedom. Cerberus, we find ourselves at a crossroads. Hades' rule threatens us all, and the alliance of Zeus with the mortals only compounds our peril. Medusa, you speak of danger, yet you come proposing an alliance. What is it you suggest? A union, Cerberus. Together, we can overthrow Hades, ensuring he never joins forces with Zeus. Our combined strength could then turn against Zeus himself, securing our dominion over the island. I need to report back to Zeus ASAP. I see wisdom in your words. Hades cannot be trusted, and his allegiance to Zeus would spell doom for us all. My army of Cerberus Wolfmen will stand with you. We will strike at Hades, severing his grip on power. Excellent. Once Hades falls, Zeus will be vulnerable. Together, we can reshape this world in our image, free from the tyranny of gods. We begin our preparations at once. Hades will not see us coming, and by the time he realizes, it will be too late. Indeed, a new era is upon us. Let the gods and mortals alike tremble at our might. Zeus needs to know about their plan. He has to stop them in Hades before evil takes over this island. Zeus, we've got trouble. Medusa and Cerberus are plotting together. They plan to overthrow Hades and then come for you. So they aim to tip the balance in their favor. We must act swiftly. Hades, despite his ways, should not fall to their treachery. It would only make them stronger. Exactly. We need to disrupt their plans. Stop Hades from being overthrown and prevent them from joining forces against you. We'll strike at Hades' base first. Without his stronghold, he can't amass a larger army of the dead. It's our best chance to contain the threat and keep the balance intact. I'll go find hope. We'll get ready to take on Medusa and Cerberus. Be careful, Johnsy. Medusa and Cerberus are cunning and dangerous. Gather hope and your allies. Once I've dealt with Hades, we'll unite against this new threat. We'll be ready. Together, we'll make sure their plot unravels before they can strike. This ends now. Sky God, Hades' wrath will be upon you. I'm not here to make payments. I'm here to make changes. You can't defeat us all, Zeus. Guess I'll have to prove you wrong. One zap at a time. Your reign of terror is crumbling, Hades. Just like this statue. You dare to challenge me in my own domain? I'm not here for a family reunion, Hades. I'm here to end your tyranny.
Enough, brothers. This conflict solves nothing and only brings more suffering. Dear Aphrodite, always the peacemaker. But peace is a luxury we can't afford. This place is incredible. Poseidon sure knows how to live. Let's just hope he's willing to help us. We need all the allies we can get. John C. and Hope, emissaries of Zeus. What brings you to my watery domain? Poseidon, we seek your aid. Zeus faces a grave threat from Medusa and Cerberus, who conspire against him. We must unite to prevent their dark ambitions from coming to fruition. Zeus is not just my ally, but my brother. Our battles against Hades are legend, and I will not abandon Zeus in his time of need. Tell me, what is your plan? We're rallying the resistance, preparing to stand against Medusa and Cerberus. Zeus is confronting Hades, and we need to ensure they don't overpower him. Very well. You shall have my support. Gather your forces and be ready. When the time comes, we will strike as one. A tidal wave against our foes. Thank you, Poseidon. With your help, we stand a chance against the darkness that threatens our world. Let's get back to the others. It's time to prepare for battle. The forces of Hades have been scattered and the underworld is in disarray. Hades himself has slipped away, but his power is greatly diminished. We've also made progress. We sought out Poseidon, and he's agreed to join us against Medusa and Cerberus. With Poseidon's strength added to our cause, we stand a much better chance. He's ready to fight by your side. Your efforts have bolstered our ranks and brought new hope to our cause. With Poseidon's aid and your unwavering courage, we will face this threat head on and emerge victorious. Let us prepare for the battle ahead. Medusa and Cerberus will not expect our combined might. Together, we will end their treachery and restore peace to this realm. We'll gather the resistance and be ready to strike. This is our chance to turn the tide. Guys, come check out this crazy new game called Candy vs. Veggies. Description. Collect your team's items in the middle, a candy or a chili. Get it back to your base to score points and try win the game. Defend your base from the other team. And make sure you watch your back before it's too... All right, brother, here's the challenge. Sneak in there and grab the golden Cerberus statue. Simple for the god of the sea, right? You think it's that easy, huh? You're on. But when I come out with that statue, you owe me a year's supply of fish sticks. Easy does it, Poseidon. Don't wait the... Oh, great. That's not going to buff out. Nice doggies. Uh, I'm more of a cat person, actually. Whoa. Okay, this was a bad idea. The statue was, uh, already broken when I got there. Sure, brother. Let's just call it a draw.
And then he just slipped and slid all over the place. Poseidon, the god of the sea, and everyone, more like the god of wet floors. Perhaps we should assign you to janitorial duties, Poseidon. Clearly you have a knack for mopping up. Don't be too harsh, Artemis. He did manage to unleash a pack of wolves instead of stealing a statue. That's gotta count for something, right? At least I didn't. Didn't what? Managed to bring back a single statue? Oh wait, you did bring back something. A great story for us to laugh about. Laugh now, gods, but the tides may turn sooner than you think. You ever feel like no matter what you do, it's just never enough? All the time, my man. But hey, that's life, right? We keep brewing. It's just my brothers, you know. Zeus with his thunderbolts. Hades with his underworld shenanigans. And there I am, making waves and mopping floors, apparently. Well, to me, you're the god who brought the sea into this little shop. That's pretty epic. To making waves, no matter how small. To the unsung heroes and the epic tales yet to be told. Besides, who needs to steal statues when you've got the whole ocean at your beck and call? You're right. Let Zeus have his lightning. I've got some tides to turn. Poseidon, your escapades have been the subject of much amusement. But it's time to turn the tide. Midas has returned, and his yacht looms too close to our realm for comfort. I'll handle it, Zeus. Consider it an opportunity to wash away past mishaps. Indeed? Well, this is your chance. Prove that the depth of your resolve matches the depth of your seas. Don't underestimate Midas, Poseidon. His touch is not the only trick up his sleeve. Thank you, Artemis. I'll navigate these waters carefully. Let's hope he understands the gravity of this tide. Our amusement aside, Poseidon's success is vital. I'll show my brother that I'm not to be messed with. Time to take out the bad guys. Ah, Poseidon, god of the seas. What an honor. Here to join the festivities? I, uh, I came here on official business, Midas. But it seems I've misjudged the situation. Nonsense, my divine friend. Today we celebrate. Battles can wait. Now, how about a drink? I insist. Never thought I'd see a god at one of our shindigs. Cheers, Poseidon. To unexpected friendships and the joys of a boat day. Poseidon, this is how you execute a mission? Fraternizing with our adversaries, indulging in mortal pleasures while duty calls. Zeus, it wasn't like that. I was assessing the situation, gaining their trust. Uh... Gaining their trust or forgetting your responsibilities. You were tasked with taking down Midas, not having a boat party. Brother, I realize I lost sight of the mission. But I've learned something valuable today. Something that might be crucial in understanding our enemies. Learnings are valuable, yes. But they should not come at the cost of our objectives, our brotherhood, our pantheon. Relies on each of us fulfilling our roles. 
I will make this right, Zeus. I'll prove to you and to all of Olympus that my dedication is unwavering. See that you do, Poseidon. Our future might well depend on it. Here's your chance to redeem yourself, brother. Stand with me and let's show Ares the true strength of our unity. I won't let you down this time, Zeus. Let's bring some justice to this dark place. threaten the balance we strive to maintain. Well fought, brother. Today you've proven your worth and more. I fear my human form is no match for the might of Ares. Poseidon, you've shown your mettle in battle, yet I sense there's more to unlock within you. This realm, this waterfall, holds the key to unleashing a deeper power. What do you mean, Zeus? What are you proposing? To protect our domain, to face the challenges ahead, you must evolve, become more than you are. This waterfall, it's, it's a crucible of transformation. You don't have to do this, Zeus. This is the beginning of a new chapter. With this transformation, you're not just a god of the sea, but a true protector of our realm. This, this is incredible. I can feel the currents, the tides, the very essence of the sea within me. Your form now reflects your true nature, Poseidon. You're not just a god among us. You are the embodiment of the seas themselves. With these powers, I vow to defend our realm, to be the guardian the world needs. Thank you, Zeus, for believing in me, for guiding me through this transformation. So, the sea god returns. What tricks have you brought this time, Poseidon? No tricks, Ares. Just the unleashed fury of the ocean itself. Let this be a lesson, Ares. Never underestimate the depths of one's resolve. Keep your eyes sharp. Hades' guards are known for their ruthlessness. We can't afford any mistakes. Please, these guards will be nothing more than decorative statues by the time I'm done with them. Another night guarding the Lord of the Dead. Why couldn't I have been stationed at Olympus? All clear on the western front. This place gives me the creeps, though. I swear I saw a statue blink earlier. Blink at this, darling. That's two guards down. We need to keep the momentum. Hades won't be as easy to surprise. 
Let's hope he's all as stone-hearted as they say. I'd love to add his face to my collection. If it isn't my dear niece and her Wolfman companion, to what do I owe this unexpected visit? We're here to put an end to your schemes, Hades. Your alliance with Zeus threatens us all. We don't trust you, Hades. Power runs in the family, but so does betrayal. Such accusations. And here, I thought we were family. If it's a fight you want, I'm more than happy to oblige. Move quick! He is attacking! You may rule the underworld, Hades, but you don't rule us. Leaving so soon, Medusa. No matter. I'll deal with you later. As for you, Cerberus, let's see if you're as tough as they say. This isn't over, Hades. We will rise against you again. Bold words for a captive creature. Rest assured, I have special plans for you, Cerberus. Cerberus, you find yourself at a crossroads. Obey me, and your wolf empire remains untouched. Defy me, and watch it crumble to ashes. Why should we trust you, Hades? Your words are as shadowy as your realm. Because, my dear beast, I have a plan that will serve us both. You seek to prove my allegiance lies not with Zeus, correct? What better way than to strike at his heart? I intend to kidnap Zeus's beloved daughter, Aphrodite. A move that will undoubtedly shatter any illusion of camaraderie between my brother and me. And what role do we play in this scheme of yours? You will be the key to our success. Your strength, your ferocity, essential for our mission. Help me capture Aphrodite, and I assure you, your loyalty will be richly rewarded. Very well, Hades. We will aid you in this endeavor. But remember, our allegiance is to our empire, not to you. Of course. Let us begin preparations. Together, we'll turn the tide in this little game of gods. Hello, peasant. Remember, we need to be swift and silent. Aphrodite's chambers are just ahead. Let's make this quick. The sooner we have her, the sooner we can turn our attention to Zeus. Surprise, darling. Let's ensure she remains asleep. We can't afford any surprises. Zeus will be beside himself with rage when he discovers she's missing. Exactly. His fury will weaken him, distract him, and with Aphrodite under our control, we'll have the leverage we need to dethrone the King of Gods. Aphrodite, where on earth is she gone? Speak, what transpired here? My lord, it was Hades and Cerberus. They came out of the shadows. We couldn't stop them. They were too powerful, Lord Zeus. They headed towards the princess's chambers. We tried to stop them, but... Hades will pay for this treachery. He dares to strike at my heart to take my daughter. Secure the castle. Let no one in or out without my word. I must retrieve Aphrodite and bring Hades to justice. Cerberus, release my daughter and surrender or face the full wrath of Olympus. Zeus. 
I am bound by loyalty to Hades. I cannot yield so easily, even to you. Tell me where Hades has taken Aphrodite. Speak, or suffer further. Hades. He has her in his underworld lair. He forced my cooperation, threatening my own realm. He plans to use her to weaken you, to distract you from his true intentions. Thank you, Cerberus. Your honesty may yet spare your domain from my fury. I will stop Hades' rescue Aphrodite and end his vile machinations. This I swear as King of the Gods. Tell me, niece. What does Zeus plan for me? Share your father's secrets. And perhaps I'll show mercy. You'll get nothing from me, Hades. My father will come for me. And your twisted schemes will crumble. Such loyalty. Admirable, but foolish. Let's see if your resolve holds, once you're under my influence. Now, you will obey me. Follow, and witness the depth of my resolve. Understand the futility of Zeus's opposition. Soon, Zeus will realize the gravity of his mistake in challenging me. And you, my dear, will be the instrument of his undoing. Lord, the stronghold is abandoned. It's as if they knew we were coming. No sign of struggle or haste. It's like they vanished into thin air. Aphrodite, my daughter, where are you? She's not here. Hades has taken her elsewhere, a move to taunt and weaken me. Zeus, we will scour the island, turn over every stone if we must, to find the princess in Hades. No corner of this world will be left unchecked. We'll bring Lady Aphrodite back to Olympus. Do so, and swiftly. Here we are, my dear. The heart of Zeus's domain. What better place to begin our little rebellion than in his own throne room? Go on, Aphrodite. Show your father what it feels like to have his world turned upside down. Destroy this room. Yes, that's it. Let Zeus feel the sting of betrayal, the pain of loss. He won't be so high and mighty when he sees what we've done to his precious throne room. Once Zeus is weakened by this personal attack, I'll raise an army, an unstoppable force of darkness. Together, we will not only defeat Zeus, but also claim Olympus itself. Enough, Hades, return my daughter and cease this madness. Ah, Zeus, so predictably heroic. Did you really think I'd bow down and obey just because you demanded it? My child, I will have this spell broken. You will be free from Hades' influence. We will make Hades pay for what he has done. He will regret the day he dared to strike against our family. So you're Cerberus, the one looking to get cash for your own tattoo shop. That's me. 
And who are you? The guy who's gonna fund my dream? I might just be. I've got a job for you. Ever heard of Grim Gate? Place where the bravest souls turned into the most restless ones. Ghosts don't scare me. But why should I care about some haunted battleground? Because of this. It's not just any statue, kid. It's made of solid gold. And legends say it's imbued with powers beyond your wildest dreams. Gold and power, huh? Sounds like my kind of gig. What's the catch? The catch is the place itself. Grimgate is surrounded by toxic green water, lethal to touch, deadly to breathe. That's why I need someone disposable. Disposable, eh? Nice to know where I stand. And why aren't you going yourself? Let's just say, the air there doesn't agree with me, but you, you're young, resilient. Resilient and reckless. All right, I'm in. But when I come back with this mythical pup, you better have my cash. You'll get your money, don't worry. Just remember, watch out for the dogs. Dogs, spirits, and toxic water. What's next? A three-headed snake? Grimgate. Here comes your next legend. Okay, Cerberus. Just grab the statue and get out. How hard can it be? There it is. Just sitting there. Yeah, right. Like it's gonna be that easy. Great. The welcoming committee. Show yourselves. Oh, come on. I didn't sign up for ghost wolves. This isn't how I plan my day. Enough of this. Let's get you out of here, young boy. Zeus, did you just... save me? This place is no ground for the unprepared. You're lucky I was nearby. Let's get you out of here before more of them come. Ah, uh, my dear brother. Always playing the hero. But don't get too comfortable, Zeus. The boy's ordeal is far from over. The poison has already taken hold. The game is just beginning, brother. Let's see how you deal with what's to come. What's... what's happening to me? You've been afflicted by the toxic magic of Grimgate, Cerberus. The same energy that powers those spectral wolves now flows through you. I was just trying to get that statue to start my tattoo shop. I didn't sign up for this. The allure of dreams can lead us into shadowed paths, but fear not. We can counteract the poison. However, you must remain here for your safety and that of others. Fine. I'll stay. But make it quick, Zeus. I don't like feeling like a caged beast. Keep watch over our guest. Ensure he remains within his quarters. His condition must not worsen before we obtain the cure. Understood, my lord. I'll guard him with my life. This isn't the end, Cerberus. Not by a long shot. What? What's happening to me? 
This pain, it's like nothing I've ever felt. No, no, not like this. What have I become? Is everything all right in here? What was that sound? By the gods. What has happened to you? What has transpired here? My Lord Zeus. The boy. He's... changed. The poison? It's transformed him, not just a curse, but a metamorphosis into something formidable. A new monster was born under my roof last night. This is a grave matter that cannot go unaddressed. We must find him before he succumbs entirely to this beastly nature or harms others. Gather your strength and alert the others. We have a hunt before us. Cerberus must be found, not as a quarry, but as one lost who we seek to save from his own curse. May the fates be kind to you, young Cerberus. Your journey is far from over, and we must guide you back to the light before the darkness consumes you entirely. Why am I here? What's pulling me back to this cursed place? Welcome back, Cerberus. I see my little gift has taken effect. You're quite the creature now. Hades? What have you done to me? Merely helped you realize your potential, my dear boy. You see, that poison wasn't just a curse. It was a catalyst for your true power. You can't fight what you've become, Cerberus. Embrace it. Embrace your destiny under my guidance. I'll never be your puppet. I'm not a monster. I am more than what you've made me, Hades. I am Cerberus, and I will not bow to you. This is far from over, young wolf. We shall see where your path leads. Impressive display, Cerberus. But did you truly believe you could defy your nature? Your very essence, crafted by my hand. What are you talking about? You're behind this? Why? Oh, my dear boy. It was all by design. Your journey, your transformation, even your little rebellion. Mere steps in a grander scheme. You... you used me? For what? What's this grand scheme of yours? To create the perfect guardian for the underworld. One bound by blood and spirit to its realm. You, Cerberus, are that guardian. A bridge between the living and the dead. No, I won't be your puppet, Hades. I won't be a monster. It's too late for choices, young one. The poison wasn't just a tool for transformation. It was a binding agent, linking your soul to the underworld itself. Embrace your destiny, Cerberus. Rage against it if you must. But in the end, you will stand by my side. Guardian of the gate, keeper of the damned. This isn't the end, Hades. I'll find a way. I won't let this curse define me. So this is it. My new home. A place I never chose. For a destiny I never wanted. 
Embrace your new role, your new family. Together, we will reshape the realms, starting with Fortnite. If we're to be allies, know this. I'll play my part, but I'll never be your puppet. Oh, I wouldn't have it any other way. They're what make you valuable, Cerberus. Together, we'll usher in a new era. I may walk in the shadows, but I haven't lost my light. One day I'll break these chains. Until then, I'll play the game, and I'll play it my way. Hades, I warned you about creating your own Fortnite deathmatch game. I'm here to stop you and end this silly quest. You fool, Zeus. Everyone loves my game, and they will watch you die as they play. Have you any last word before you vanish into the dust beneath my feet? Please save me, save my life and my kingdom. Go play Hades' new game, quick hurry. The code is on the screen now, and in the description. Oh, and don't forget to like and favorite the game, or this Greek god will be no more. Come on, Jill. You call that a defensive stance? My grandmother's sea urchins can do better. Doing my best, Lord Poseidon. I'll master the Daywalker's move if it's the last thing I do. What are you doing here? This is no place for idle spectators. Off with you now. I, I was just admiring your training methods, Lord Poseidon. I thought I might learn something from watching the Master at work. The only thing you'll learn here is how to be a distraction. I have no time for admirers. Focus on your own path, Lyra. And let me focus on mine. Tough love, huh? Should I try that with the Coral Buddies next? Just focus on not tripping over your own fins, Jill. We have got a long day ahead. This is it, Lyra. Just be sincere. Show him your heart. How could he not see how much I care? Lord Poseidon, I've been meaning to talk to you. I've admired your strength and wisdom from afar, and I... What are you doing here? Can't you see I'm in the middle of something important? I just wanted a moment of your time. I have these feelings, and I thought... Feelings? Now is not the time nor the place. Restored Reels is no playground for infatuations, Lyra. You should know better. I understand. My apologies, Lord Poseidon. I didn't mean to offend. Focus on your duties, Lyra. Don't let these silly feelings cloud your judgment. Orochimaru... Your skills are required for a task of delicate nature. It's a matter that must be resolved quietly, away from Olympus's prying eyes. Lord Poseidon, I am at your service. What troubles the god of the seas so deeply that he seeks my particular talents? There's a mortal, Lyra, who has become entangled in my affairs. Her presence, her admiration, it's become a distraction, a nuisance that I can no longer tolerate. And you wish for this distraction to be eliminated? Yes, but it must be done discreetly. No one must suspect my involvement or that of any deity. It's a matter that must be resolved in the shadows. Discretion is my specialty, Lord Poseidon. Consider your problem as good as resolved. However, every service comes with a price. Name it. Olympus is rich in treasures and secrets. What is it that you desire? Eh, uh, V-Bucks, obviously. For now, rest assured that your distraction will be taken care of. Then we have an agreement. Proceed with caution, Orochimaru. The eyes of Olympus see much, but I trust you'll ensure they see nothing of this.
Who are you? What do you want from me? Ah, Lyra, right? Your infatuation with Poseidon has been... troublesome. I'm here to rectify that situation. I don't understand. I've caused no harm. Please, you don't have to do this. It's not about what you've done. It's about what you could disrupt. Now hold still. This will be transformative. What's happening to me? What have I become? You've become a solution, Medusa. A force to be reckoned with. Is this my fate? To be feared, isolated, powerful? If the world will only see me as a monster, then a monster they shall see. I will carve my own path, with or without Poseidon's gaze upon me. So this is your power. Fascinating. Ah, well, well. If it isn't the talk of Olympus. Medusa, you've certainly evolved. Evolution born of betrayal, Hades. I've come to realize my place is not among those who scorn me, but with those who respect my power. And what brings you to our doorstep, Medusa? What do you seek in the company of the underworld's finest? An alliance. Poseidon thinks he can discard me like a mere pebble in his vast ocean. I intend to show him just how formidable a pebble can be. I admire your spirit, Medusa. Poseidon has indeed grown too complacent in his watery throne. Together, we can shake the very foundations of his kingdom. I want him to regret the day he turned his back on me. With your forces, Hades and Cerberus's might, we can dethrone the so-called god of the seas. Our fangs and claws are at your disposal, Medusa. Poseidon will learn to fear the bite of the underworld. Then let us bind this pact with the darkness that unites us. We will bring Poseidon to his knees and show Olympus that our wrath is not to be taken lightly. To our future victories and the downfall of our enemies, may they tremble at the mention of our names. Just one shot. That's all it takes to end this charade and make him pay for everything. No, stay focused. Remember your purpose, Medusa. This is for your dignity, for your revenge. Silence! Everyone, calm down. Guards, secure the perimeter. Whoever you are, this cowardly act won't go unpunished. Show yourself. This time, there will be no mistakes. Poseidon will pay for his disregard, for his arrogance. Time for a car bomb. Always sending me on these errands. What did he forget this time? His trident-shaped keychain, his coral-encrusted sunglasses. No, this isn't right. He's not the target. What in Poseidon's realm was that? Poseidon, you may have escaped this time, but I'm not done. Your downfall is coming. Look at what I've become, a creature of legend yet alone in the dark. I once longed for his gaze, for his affection. Now, all who look upon me will know only fear and stone. Is this not power, though? Is there not strength in being feared in commanding such a formidable presence? Hear me, Poseidon, and all of Olympus. The woman you spurned is no more. In her place stands a Medusa, a force of nature, unforgiving and unyielding. Is that 
Medusa, here in the cafe? Don't look at her eyes. Remember what they say about her gaze. Medusa, please. I don't want any trouble. Just let us. Enough, Medusa. Your quarrel isn't with these mortals. Leave now, or face the consequences. I have no fight with you, Aphrodite, but mark my words. This is far from over. Don't worry, Gwen. We'll find a way to reverse this. Medusa may have embraced her darkness, but we will not abandon our light. Right this way, Mr. Zeus. We've got a lightning view suite just for you. Top floor with all the divine amenities. Lightning view, you say? Now that's what I call a room with a spark. Today, Zeus will become a permanent part of Mount Olympus's decor. Just need the perfect moment. Whoa, lady! Ever heard a knocking? No, not him. Where's Zeus? Watch closely, Jill. You're about to see what true mastery of the water element looks like. I've heard rumors, Poseidon, but seeing is believing. Show me what you've got. That's just the beginning. Check this out. Incredible, Poseidon. I knew you were powerful, but this, this is on another level. Thanks, Jill. It took some practice, but I've finally tapped into my true potential. And you know what they say, practice makes perfect. Or in my case, nearly divine. Well, if you're taking applications for apprentices, sign me up. I could use a few of those moves in my next fight against the tomato head in candy versus fruit code on screen now. We'll continue your training tomorrow. But be warned, it's going to be a deep dive. Just promise me one thing, Poseidon. When I master those moves, let's not tell Zeus. I don't want to end up as his new sparring partner. No promises, Jill, but I'll consider it. Well, if it isn't the great Poseidon, Nice tricks back there, but really... Shouldn't you be back in the sea with the rest of the whales? Hey now, we're all about the positive vibes here. Poseidon's just showcasing his talents just like anyone else would. No need for the saltiness, right? Thanks, Gil. I guess not everyone appreciates a good water show, huh? Don't sweat it, man. You're a literal god. You've got bigger fish to fry than some landlubber's opinion. You're right, Gil. Let's focus on the positives, like how you're going to master punched up tomorrow. Oh boy, as long as it doesn't involve getting punched, I mean. juice a bit hard lately you're looking a bit jiggly in the middle yeah man maybe lay off the ocean's buffet we wouldn't want you to sink next time you hit the water with that jelly belly ah very funny guys you know as a god i can change my form at will this is just 
you know, how I like it right now. Maybe I should check my reflection in the water, excuse me. Think we overdid it with the jokes? Maybe. He's usually all about the waves and the tides, not so much about the laughs. Poseidon, what storm brings you here with such anger? It's about us, Zeus. About how we're seen and perceived by others. You're revered, feared. I'm just a subject of jokes and teasing. This is about your appearance, brother. You know as well as I that our forms are but a reflection of our essence. Why does this trouble you so? Because Zeus, while you sit here with your rock-hard abs, I'm out there being mocked for my jelly belly or my liquid form. Where's the respect? the awe that should accompany a god of the seas. Poseidon, our roles are different, as are our realms. I've never doubted your power or your command of the oceans. Why should the idle chatter of mortals or others shake your confidence? It's not just idle chatter, Zeus. It's about wanting to be valued, not just tolerated or laughed at. I want to be seen as more than just Poseidon, the fun god. I see your point, brother. But know this, you are valued, respected, and admired, far beyond what you might perceive. Your domain is vast, your power immense. Do not let the whispers of the few cloud the reverence of the many. Perhaps you're right, but it's hard, Zeus, when every glance seems to carry a snicker, every compliment a hidden gag. Then let us show them together the true might of Poseidon. Let them know that the god of the seas is no less formidable than the ruler of Olympus is. Hades, brother, I seek a chat with you. To what do I owe this rare honor? Have the tides carried you to my domain for counsel or for conflict? Neither. I come seeking understanding. You, cloaked in darkness and power, command respect and fear. I, despite my own domain's vastness, am met with teasing and ridicule. How do you do it, Hades? How do you ensure you're taken seriously? Seriousness, Poseidon, comes not from form, but from essence. My realm, my rules, and my really cool mask. They all align to project the power I embody. Perhaps I've been too concerned with the surface, neglecting the depths of my own power. Indeed. The seas are both beautiful and terrifying, Poseidon. Be the storm, not just the calm waters. Let them see the depth of your dominion. Thank you, Hades. Your words have given me much to ponder. I shall seek to embody the tempest as much as the tranquil sea. Oh, and next time you call, let me know. I'll be sure to get some donuts for you. Here. Where the sea meets the land, I find myself at a crossroads. Do I continue to endure the jests and doubts, or do I embrace the solitude of the deep, away from the eyes and expectations of others? I am Poseidon, god of the seas, yet I feel adrift, caught in a current of uncertainty. Perhaps it is time to retreat to vanish beneath the waves where my true power lies. No, I will not be defined by the fleeting opinions of mortals or immortals alike. I am the storm and the calm, the depth and the surface. My journey is mine to shape like the waves that shape the shore. Poseidon, may I join you in this beautiful sanctuary? Of course, Aphrodite. Your company is always a balm to the soul. You've been on quite the journey, haven't you? The waves of self-doubt can be more challenging than the stormiest seas. Indeed, I've been contemplating my place in this world, my role as a deity. 
It's not easy when you feel misunderstood or reduced to mere caricature. Poseidon, remember that your power and worth extend far beyond the perceptions of others. I've been so concerned with how I'm perceived that I've neglected to truly value what I am, to love myself as I am. Thank you, Aphrodite. So, what's the plan, Poseidon? More water vortex training today? Actually, Gil, I have a different kind of training in mind today. One that's about inner strength and self-acceptance. I am Poseidon, god of the seas. My power is vast. My domain deep and mysterious. I am not defined by others' perceptions, but by my own essence. That's right. You're the master of the oceans, not just some caricature. Show them who you really are, Poseidon. I command the tides, the storms, and the calm. I am both the tranquil sea and the raging wave. I embrace all that I am. Now that's the Poseidon I know. The whole island should see this side of you. Powerful, assured, and unapologetically you. Your friendship and support mean more to me than you know. Together, we'll face whatever comes our way with heads held high. And hey, if anyone gives you trouble, just remind them who controls the seas. Hello, I'm Poseidon. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm April. The pleasure is all mine. Aphrodite has told me so much about you. So, April, do you frequent this cafe often? I must admit, the ambiance is quite enchanting. I do. It's a little haven in the midst of chaos. But enough about me. I'm curious about you. Aphrodite mentioned you're quite the force of nature. Well, let's just say I have my moments. But tonight, I'm just Poseidon, here to enjoy your company and this delightful setting. It's refreshing to meet someone who's not just about surface appearances. You have a depth to you, Poseidon. That's quite captivating. That means a great deal to me. I've been learning to embrace my depths, and it's wonderful to share that with someone who appreciates it. You know, April, there's something about the sea at night. It's both calming and invigorating. I couldn't agree more. It's like the universe's way of showing us there's beauty in complexity. Your company this evening has been a true gift. I've been on a journey of self-discovery, and tonight feels like a significant step on that path. Everyone deserves to be seen for who they truly are, Poseidon, and you're no exception. For tonight, for the conversation, for the connection, no matter where my journey takes me, I'll cherish this moment. And I'll cherish it too. There it is, Olympus, the stronghold of my oh-so-righteous brother. Are you ready to make history? Sir, are we sure about this? I mean, it's Zeus we're talking about, the lightning guy. Oh, come on. What's life without a little thunderstorm? Besides, I have you with me. What could possibly go wrong? Well, when you put it that way, let's shock them. That's the spirit. And to the guys at home, remember to check out our new game, Lava vs. Ice. The code is in the description. Onward, to Olympus. And let's keep it stealthy. We're not dropping in for tea. Now, where would Zeus hide his little power trinket? Halt! Intruder! Defile is such a strong word. I prefer uninvited renovation. Next. You'll pay for this, Hades. Oh, a double feature. I'm thrilled. Olympus shall not fall to the likes of you. I admire your spirit, but it's curtains for you, my friend. Ah, there you are, my precious. 
Time to go home with Daddy. Well, this has been fun. A bit too easy, if you ask me. But then, when you're as fabulous as I am, what isn't? Tell Zeus, better luck next time. Medusa, show yourself, Serpent. You know exactly why I'm here. To what do I owe the displeasure? My statue, the source of my power, has been stolen, and I know it was you, traitor. Me? Steal from you? Zeus, you're mistaken. I've been here, tending to my snakes. A likely story. As if your snake's petrification isn't proof enough of your treachery. I swear on the river Styx, I'm innocent. Why would I betray the Pantheon? Enough. Your lies fall on deaf ears. For your crime, you will pay dearly. Stop. You're destroying everything. Can't you see you're wrong? Justice is blind, Medusa, and so is my wrath. This isn't over. The truth will come out. Zeus, look at the chaos you've wrought. On what grounds did you unleash such fury? Artemis, you do not understand. The theft of my statue is an affront to my authority. I must act decisively. Decisively? No, you acted recklessly. Medusa was no thief, yet you punished her without a shred of evidence. I am the ruler of the gods. It is my right to deliver justice as I see fit. Justice? This is not justice, this is tyranny. And I will not stand idly by while you tarnish the name of the gods with your vendettas. Artemis, we are family. Do not turn your back on me over this misunderstanding. This is no misunderstanding, Zeus. You've allowed your anger and pride to blind you. I cannot follow a leader who sees power as a weapon against the innocent. What would you have me do? Admit to a mistake and show weakness? Yes. If that's what it takes to be just and fair, I will not follow you down this path. I will seek the truth and restore honor to our name. Artemis, we need unity now more than ever. Not at the cost of our integrity. I will find the true thief and bring them to justice. The right way. Medusa, I... Come to see the fruits of your father's justice, Artemis? No. Medusa, I'm here to apologize, not on behalf of Zeus, but as someone who values justice and truth above all. Your words mean little in the shadow of such destruction. What is it that you truly seek here? An alliance. Zeus's actions are unforgivable, and I cannot stand by while injustice reigns. You were wronged, Medusa, and I wish to help set things right. And why should I trust you, a goddess among those who've turned their backs on me? Because I believe in balance, in righting wrongs, and because I, too, am tired of Zeus's tyranny. And what do you propose we do, Huntress? We find the truth. We expose the real thief and show Olympus that Zeus's impulsiveness has consequences. Together, we can restore your honor and teach him a lesson in humility. A tempting offer, Artemis, very well. But know this, my trust is not easily earned. Then let us earn it together. Are you with me? For justice, for vengeance, I am with you. Apocalypse the dynamisas. Doste muton elenho ton uranon. Having trouble, master? Not now, Cerberus. Can't you see I'm in the middle of something crucial? Oh, I can see perfectly. I see a mighty god, flailing at a statue that won't budge. Do you think you could do better? This is no simple task. I'm just a guardian of the underworld, not a thief who steals powerless trinkets. It's not powerless. It's stubborn. There's a difference. Of course, Master. 
Perhaps the statue is just not that into you. There must be a key. A secret to unlocking its potential. Zeus wouldn't guard it so fiercely otherwise. Maybe the key is something you can't steal or force. Never thought of that. Mm-hmm. You might be onto something, Cerberus. But no. It can't be that simple. Sometimes, Master. The greatest power lies in understanding, not in conquest. Enough philosophy. I'll find a way. With or without. Your cryptic advice. So, the mighty Hades can't unlock the statue's powers. How... enlightening. If brute force and dark magic won't awaken it, what will? And more importantly, how can this knowledge serve our cause? If Hades seeks power from the statue, we'll give him a statue, but not the one he expects. A decoy imbued with a trap could be the key to retrieving what he stole. This will be our Trojan horse. Hades' greed will be his downfall. He won't be able to resist the lure of another powerful artifact, especially when it seems to fall into his lap so conveniently. It's time to set our plan in motion. Hades, your reign of unchecked power ends now. This is our foundation, but it needs your touch, Medusa. Your magic can make it truly compelling. I understand. We'll create a statue so enticing, even Hades won't resist its allure. We need to embed it with a curse. Something that will weaken Hades, drain his ambition and strength. I have just the curse in mind, a spell that saps the will, leaving the victim lost in their own hubris. That's perfect, Medusa. Now for the finishing touch. This will be our bait. Let's see if Hades can resist the temptation of a new powerful artifact. And when he takes the bait, the curse will take hold, weakening him enough for us to reclaim what's rightfully Zeus's. And perhaps teaching him a lesson in humility and respect. At last, another chance to unlock the power within. This time, nothing will stop me. Na apokalipsi ti dinami, na mudosi ton elenko, na yini iteli siu, ye to lito nura non. Reveal the power, grant me control, let my will be the command of the heavens. What's happening? This isn't what I must focus. Why is my ambition fading? No, this can't be. I am Hades. At last, order is restored and the power of the gods is safe once again. What treachery is this? No, it cannot be. The tyranny, the recklessness, it ends now. Artemis, my daughter, you... you would stand against your father? Against the king of the gods? It's not about standing against you, Zeus. It's about standing up for justice, for fairness. I am the ruler. I cannot be... frozen in stone. Even the king of the gods must answer for his actions. This is the balance of the universe, the order you so cherish. Perhaps in time, you'll understand the lessons we've all had to learn. Let's ensure the power of the gods is never again used so recklessly. Together we can forge a new path. One where justice prevails and even the mightiest are held accountable.
All right, Brutus, this is it. When I was down in Hades' dungeon, I stumbled upon something big. Hades' power source is here, and we're going to find it. Man, can you imagine me, Brutus, with powers like a Greek god? I'll be unstoppable. Focus, Brutus. This isn't a joyride. We need to be silent as shadows. One wrong step, and we could awaken the dead souls Hades keeps here. Dead souls? Like actual ghosts? Exactly. And trust me, you don't want to bump into a ghost down here. They're not the friendly type. Got it. No waking the dead. Just in and out, like ninja spies. See that chamber over there? I believe that's where we'll find what we're looking for. Stay close and keep your eyes peeled. Hey, if we run into any ghosts, can I just tell them I'm Midas and turn them to gold? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. Now come on, let's move. So, once we find the power source, we need to be quick about extracting its essence. Time will be of the essence and... Are you listening to me, Brutus? Brutus, don't touch it. I was just looking. You see how shiny this thing is. It's like it was made for me. Brutus, no! Hey! Run! There is too many of them. Retreat! Midas, help! Please don't kill me! Let him go, Hades. I'm afraid your little infiltration ends here, gentlemen. As for you, it's time to decide your fate. Hades, I warned you about creating your own Fortnite deathmatch game. I'm here to stop you and end this silly quest. You fool Zeus. Everyone loves my game. And they will watch you die as they play. Now Zeus. Have you any last word before you vanish into the dust beneath my feet? Please save me, save my life and my kingdom. Go play Hades' new game, quick hurry. The code is on the screen now, and in the description. Oh, and don't forget to like and favorite the game, or this Greek god will be no more. You fools. Did you really think you could sneak into my domain, the sacred battleground of lost souls, and not face retribution? Every soul that falls, every drop of blood shed, it fuels my strength, coursing through Grimgate like a river of despair. We acknowledge our mistakes. Please spare Brutus. It was my plan, my error. Punish me if you must, but let him go. We'll do anything, Hades. Anything. Just... just give us a chance to make it right. Yes, we'll serve you. We can be valuable in your ongoing battle against Zeus. Just think of the advantage you'd have with us on your side. Serve me, you say. A tempting offer indeed. Very well. I shall spare your lives for now. But remember, betray me, and you'll yearn for the mercy of death. You have our loyalty, Hades. We won't let you down. Let's see what games we can play, with my new pieces on the board.
Thank... thank you, Hades. We won't forget this mercy. What I offer you is an opportunity. Serve me. Bring souls to Grimgate and fight against Zeus and his divine family. Fail, and you'll find yourselves wishing for a fate far kinder than my wrath. Fight against Zeus? That's... Uh, that's no small task. Did you think your service would be without challenge? You will aid me in my crusade against the gods. In return, you keep your lives and gain a fraction of my favor. We understand, Hades. We'll do what's necessary. Your enemies will become our enemies. Remember, I'll be watching. Every soul you bring fortifies our cause. Every blow you strike against Zeus and his ilk brings us closer to victory. What have we gotten ourselves into? A deal with the devil himself. But it's a chance to live, Brutus. We'll find a way to navigate this. My Lord Zeus, urgent news. Speak, guard, what news do you bring? It's Midas, my lord. He's returned to the island, transformed. He now dons a gladiator's guise, and he's aligned himself with Hades. Aligned with Hades? But why? This is troubling news indeed. Hades must be plotting something if he's recruiting allies like Midas and Brutus. Yes, my lord. They've been seen rallying forces at Grim Gate, perhaps preparing for an assault. We must not take this lightly. Gather the Council. I want Olympus on high alert for the next few days. We need to be prepared for whatever Hades is planning. I'll rally the nymphs and demigods. We'll need all the help we can get. Keep a watchful eye on Grimgate. Any movement, any unusual activity, I want to know immediately. At once, my lord. This could be the beginning of a significant conflict. We must protect our realm at all costs. We'll stand united, Zeus. Hades won't catch us off guard. And then that character, what was his name? Just tripped over nothing. I swear, movies these days can be so ridiculous. I know, right? But that's what makes them fun. Oh, hold up, what's that up ahead? Oh no, that looks bad. We should see if they need help. That's strange. There's nobody here. Where did they go? I don't like this calamity. It feels off. Let's call for help and get out of here. Gotcha. Now let's grab her and... Hey, the other one's getting away. Hey, she got away. Forget her. We have what we came for. What will we tell Hades? We were supposed to bring two. One sacrifice will suffice for tonight. Hades will understand. The important thing is, we have Calamity. What about her friend? She'll probably go to the authorities. Let her. By the time anyone believes her story, we'll have completed our mission. Hades' plan is already in motion. should be here by now. What's taking him so long? This doesn't feel right. Hades is never late for these things. What do you want with me? Why am I here? It's not us who want something from you. You're part of something bigger. Midas Brutus, leave this place at once. What? Why can't we stay? You know the rules. No one can witness the sacrifice. Depart now. But I need to see what he's doing. Understanding his power could be our key to... No way, Midas. I'm not crossing Hades. He said leave, we leave. Please, you don't have to do this. Let me go. My dear, you are about to become part of something much greater. You will be reborn, a vital piece. 
ranks of my soulless army. What are you doing to me? How may I serve you, Master? Excellent. But one final step remains. Now I know how you do it, Hades. This is how you build your army. Midas, the infection has taken over your body. Sky, you're driving like a maniac and I love it. Just keeping it interesting. We can't let Miles get away. These guys are nuts. Time to slow you down, Miles. Oh, come on, that's just rude. Did you see that flip? I think I just invented a new driving move. Remind me never to challenge you to a race, Sky. That's how we do it. Another victory for the dynamic duo. You got the spray cans, Sky. Got more colors than a rainbow. What's the plan? A little artistic expression on Poseidon's walls. Let's make sure this place is unforgettable. You take the left, I'll handle the right. Let's give them a show. What are you doing to my coffee shop? Just adding a Midas touch. Think of it as live performance art. Now that's what I call a grand opening. Time to make a splash exit. So, you two decided to have a little party without me, huh? Brutus, what's got your gears grinding? Missed out on the spray painting fun, did you? It's not about the painting, it's about being left out. I thought we were a team. Oh, come on, Brutus. Stop acting like a granny. We were just stirring up some trouble. Maybe we should have invited him. He's got that vandal at heart vibe. I could have shown you some real chaos. You know I'm the best when it comes to creating a mess. All right, all right, next time you're our lead artist, deal? Stop acting like such a baby. Whoa, calm down. I ain't no baby. Brutus the baby. Brutus the big baby. Haha, <laughs> nice one, Sky. Ah, Brutus. I see you've decided to make a spectacle. What is it you hope to achieve? Recognition. Respect. I'm tired of being the third wheel, the backup plan. You're lashing out for attention? How human of you. I'm more than what they see. I can be a leader, not just a follower. Join me, Brutus. With your skills and my guidance, we could be unstoppable. Yes. I'm not just some sidekick to be discarded. I have ambitions, skills. I want to be in the spotlight, not in the shadows. Very well. But such a transition requires a test of loyalty. Can you handle that, Brutus? Test me. I'm ready for anything. It's quite simple. I need you to bring me something. Something that Midas holds dear. If that's what it takes, I'll do it. Is there anything more exhilarating than sowing a bit of chaos, Sky? Nothing comes close. This town's never going to know what hit it. Look out. More targets up ahead. Hold on tight. Let's give them a show they won't forget. You know, with Brutus on our side, we're unstoppable. He's probably out there right now, spreading his own brand of mayhem. Yeah, Brutus is a force of nature. After this, 
Hades won't know whether to thank us or fear us, but they'll definitely remember us. To being unforgettable. Ah, uh, there's our partner in crime. Come join the celebration, Brutus. We saved you the best seat. And there's plenty of chaos left to plan. I see the two of you had quite the day without me. Of course, but there's always more mayhem to be made. You okay, Brutus? You seem... off. Maybe I want more than just being the muscle. Ever thought of that? Hey, we're all in this together. You know that. If something's bugging you, spill it. We can't have bad vibes on the team. Forget it. Just the heat of the moment. I'm in. All the way. All right then. Let's focus on what we do best. Chaos, mayhem, and a touch of madness. What am I doing? Midas and Sky. They trust me. But Hades, he's offering me everything I've ever wanted. Why is this so hard? I'm tired of being the backup, the afterthought. But is power worth it? Worth betraying my friends, my family, and all but blood? If I do this, there's no going back. I'll be the villain in their story, but the hero in mine. I'm sorry, Midas. Sky, this is my chance to shine. My chance to be more than just Brutus. We need a stronghold. A place where we can orchestrate our grand plan to dominate the island. It's time to up our game. The new players in town, the gods, have set up their domains. Hades and Zeus are the names on everyone's lips. Why don't we check out Zeus's crib? I hear it's all flashy with thunder and lightning. Might be fun to crash. Tempting, but no. We're going after something darker. Hades's castle has the edge we need. It's perfect for our brand of mischief. Right. Nothing says welcome like a lair that screams eternal damnation. Junior, it's time you put those sneaky skills to the test. I want a full report. Guards, traps, secret entrances, the works. You got it, Dad. I'll be like a ninja, a ghost. Hades won't know what hit him. That's my boy. Remember, we're not just taking a castle. We're sending a message. We're the new power in town. To our future castle. May it be as gloomy and dreadful as we dream it to be. And may it have an epic game room, you know, for strategy. To our conquest. Soon, we'll have the perfect base for our reign of awesomeness. This is almost too easy. Where's the catch? Yeah, it's quiet. Too quiet. I was expecting a little more underworld flair. Maybe they're all out for a lunch break. Do underworld folks do lunch? Well, if no one's going to stop us, I might as well get comfortable. I declare myself the new king of the underworld. Let's see any god try to challenge me now. Long live the king. So, what's the first order of business, your underworldliness? Yeah, Dad. What are we going to conquer first? I hope it's something cool. First, we solidify our hold on this place. Make it our own. Then, we'll turn our eyes to the surface. There's an island out there, just waiting for our special touch. Got it. Fortify the castle, then expand the empire. I like the sound of that. Can we have a dungeon with, like, cool traps and stuff? Of course. A dungeon with all the trimmings. But first, let's make this castle a fortress to be reckoned with. 
I'm going to go check out the dungeons. Hades, I warned you about creating your own Fortnite deathmatch game. I'm here to stop you and end this silly quest. You fool, Zeus. Everyone loves my game. And they will watch you die as they play. Now, Zeus, have you any last word before you vanish into the dust beneath my feet? Please save me, save my life and my kingdom. Go play Hades' new game, quick hurry. The code is on the screen now, and in the description. Oh, and don't forget to like and favorite the game, or this Greek god will be no more. Hades! Or should I say, former king? You think you can just waltz into my domain and claim it as your own? Ow. Quaint. We were just making ourselves at home. Hope you don't mind. Mine? Oh, I, I do more than mine. I find it... amusing. <laughs> your little invasion has given me a delightful idea. And what would that be? I think this castle could use some new decorations. Perhaps starting with the two of you, locked away in the deepest, darkest part of my dungeon. You're going to have to try harder than that to scare us. Your new eternal home, courtesy of the real king of the underworld. My hand. You'll pay for this, Hades. Consider it a parting gift from your former life. But don't worry, I have plans for you. Brutus, my son, they will come for me. You won't get away with this. Your faith in them is touching but misguided. They won't recognize you once I'm done. Rise, Ascended Midas. Embrace your new purpose. You are mine now. I obey, Master. What is your command? Your old life is over, Midas. Now, you will help me expand my dominion, crush any who oppose us, and ensure that my rule is absolute. Start our conquest here. Every man, woman, and child will become an instrument of our power. There, Midas. Show them our strength. Start with her. As you command, my lord. What's happening? Who are you? I am Ascendant Midas, herald of your new reality. You are now a soldier in Hades' army. Resistance is futile. Your will is now mine to mold. Let me go. I won't be part of your twisted plan. Join my ranks. Become my weapon. Hear me, people of this town. This is your future. Serve us or fall before us. Excellent. Continue the assault. Our army grows with each passing moment. You two will lead my growing army. We will sweep through the towns, claiming every soul for our cause. Once our ranks swell with the converted, we will lay siege to Zeus's castle. The island will fall under our shadow. 
and I will rule supreme. Your will is my command, my lord. The towns will fall before us, and their people will join your dark legion. I am your servant, Hades. Zeus and his followers won't withstand our might. Excellent. Remember, show no mercy. The weak will serve us or perish. Begin the assault at dusk. By dawn, our army will be unstoppable. All right, Brutus, this is it. When I was down in Hades' dungeon, I stumbled upon something big. Hades' power source is here, and we're going to find it. Man, can you imagine me, Brutus, with powers like a Greek god? I'll be unstoppable. Focus, Brutus. This isn't a joyride. We need to be silent as shadows. One wrong step, and we could awaken the dead souls Hades keeps here. Dead souls? Like actual ghosts? Exactly. And trust me, you don't want to bump into a ghost down here. They're not the friendly type. Got it. No waking the dead. Just in and out, like ninja spies. See that chamber over there? I believe that's where we'll find what we're looking for. Stay close and keep your eyes peeled. Hey, if we run into any ghosts, can I just tell them I'm Midas and turn them to gold? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. Now come on, let's move. So, once we find the power source, we need to be quick about extracting its essence. Time will be of the essence and... Are you listening to me, Brutus? Brutus, don't touch it. I was just looking. You see how shiny this thing is? It's like it was made for me. Brutus, no! Hey! Run! There is too many of them. Retreat! Midas, help! Please don't kill me! Let him go, Hades. I'm afraid your little infiltration ends here, gentlemen. As for you, it's time to decide your fate. Hades, I warned you about creating your own Fortnite deathmatch game. I'm here to stop you and end this silly quest. You fool, Zeus. Everyone loves my game. And they will watch you die as they play. <laughs> now, Zeus. Have you any last word before you vanish into the dust beneath my feet? Please save me, save my life and my kingdom. Go play Hades' new game, quick hurry. The code is on the screen now, and in the description. Oh, and don't forget to like and favorite the game, or this Greek god will be no more. You fools. Did you really think you could sneak into my domain, the sacred battleground of lost souls, and not face retribution? Every soul that falls, every drop of blood shed, it fuels my strength, coursing through Grimgate like a river of despair. We acknowledge our mistakes. Please spare Brutus. It was my plan, my error. 
Punish me if you must, but let him go. We'll do anything, Hades. Anything. Just... just give us a chance to make it right. Yes, we'll serve you. We can be valuable in your ongoing battle against Zeus. Just think of the advantage you'd have with us on your side. Serve me, you say. A tempting offer indeed. Very well. I shall spare your lives for now. But remember, betray me, and you'll yearn for the mercy of death. You have our loyalty, Hades. We won't let you down. Let's see what games we can play, with my new pieces on the board. Thank... thank you, Hades. We won't forget this mercy. What I offer you is an opportunity. Serve me. Bring souls to Grimgate, and fight against Zeus and his divine family. Fail, and you'll find yourselves wishing for a fate far kinder than my wrath. Fight against Zeus? That's... Uh, that's no small task. Did you think your service would be without challenge? You will aid me in my crusade against the gods. In return, you keep your lives, and gain a fraction of my favor. We understand, Hades. We'll do what's necessary. Your enemies will become our enemies. Remember, I'll be watching. Every soul you bring fortifies our cause. Every blow you strike against Zeus. And his ilk brings us closer to victory. What have we gotten ourselves into? A deal with the devil himself. But it's a chance to live, Brutus. We'll find a way to navigate this. My Lord Zeus, urgent news. Speak guard, what news do you bring? It's Midas, my lord. He's returned to the island, transformed. He now dons a gladiator's guise, and he's aligned himself with Hades. Aligned with Hades? But why? This is troubling news indeed. Hades must be plotting something if he's recruiting allies like Midas and Brutus. Yes, my lord. They've been seen rallying forces at Grim Gate, perhaps preparing for an assault. We must not take this lightly. Gather the council. I want Olympus on high alert for the next few days. We need to be prepared for whatever Hades is planning. I'll rally the nymphs and demigods. We'll need all the help we can get. Keep a watchful eye on Grimgate. Any movement, any unusual activity, I want to know immediately. At once, my lord. This could be the beginning of a significant conflict. We must protect our realm at all costs. We'll stand united, Zeus. Hades won't catch us off guard. And then that character, what was his name? Just tripped over nothing. I swear, movies these days can be so ridiculous. I know, right? But that's what makes them fun. Oh, hold up, what's that up ahead? Oh no, that looks bad. We should see if they need help. That's strange. There's nobody here. Where did they go? I don't like this calamity. It feels off. Let's call for help and get out of here. Gotcha. Now let's grab her and... Hey, the other one's getting away. Hey, she got away. Forget her. We have what we came for. What will we tell Hades? We were supposed to bring two. One sacrifice will suffice for tonight. Hades will understand. The important thing is, we have Calamity. What about her friend? She'll probably go to the authorities. Let her. By the time anyone believes her story, we'll have completed our mission. Hades' plan is already in motion. He 
should be here by now. What's taking him so long? This doesn't feel right. Hades is never late for these things. What do you want with me? Why am I here? It's not us who want something from you. You're part of something bigger. Midas Brutus, leave this place at once. What? Why can't we stay? You know the rules. No one can witness the sacrifice. Depart now. But I need to see what he's doing. Understanding his power could be our key to... No way, Midas. I'm not crossing Hades. He said leave, we leave. Please, you don't have to do this. Let me go. My dear, you are about to become part of something much greater. You will be reborn, a vital piece of my soulless army. What are you doing to me? How may I serve you, Master? Excellent. But one final step remains. Now I know how you do it, Hades. This is how you build your army. Zeus and his forces have tightened their grip on the island. It's time we shatter their stronghold. I've got a plan. What if we charm our way in, specifically through Aphrodite? She's Zeus's daughter. Seduce a goddess? That's your plan. Not just any goddess. If she falls for me, we'll have an inside track to Zeus. Intriguing. But Aphrodite is never far from Zeus's watchful eye. We'll need a diversion. What kind of diversion are we talking about? A meeting. A proposition of truce among the island's most powerful guardians. Zeus can't resist such a gathering. Get Zeus out of the castle, and I get Aphrodite out of Zeus's grasp. Clever. I'll summon Zeus, Cerberus, and Medusa under the guise of seeking peace. Meanwhile, you two infiltrate the castle and win over Aphrodite. And if this goes south... Then we resort to our usual tactics. Chaos and destruction. But first, we play the game of deception. Let's turn the tides in our favor. Aphrodite won't know what hit her. As long as we're not the ones getting hit by Zeus's lightning bolts in the end. Hades seeks a truce after all this time. I'm wary of his motives, yet we mustn't dismiss this outright. It could be a trap, my lord. Increase our defenses while I attend this meeting. If Hades is plotting something, we'll be prepared. So, Hades wants to talk peace? Huh, as if we'd ever trust that backstabber. But I'll play along, see what he's scheming. A ceasefire from Hades? Now that's interesting. But what's really behind his olive branch, I wonder? Ensure our realm is secure. I want eyes everywhere. If Hades so much as twitches in the wrong direction, I want to know. As you wish, my lord. Hades, why this sudden call for peace? It's unlike you to tire of conflict. The time for endless battle is over. I seek a truce, a chance for us all to coexist without the shadow of war. Just like that? You expect us to believe you're turning over a new leaf? There's always a catch with you, Hades. What's the real game here? I've grown weary of the strife. Our island deserves a future free from our feuds. A noble sentiment, if it's true. But trust is earned, not given freely. I understand your reservations. I'm willing to prove my intentions. Let's start small. A gesture of goodwill from each of us. And if you step out of line? Then you have my permission to unite against me. I am putting my fate in your hands as a show of my commitment to this truce. Perhaps there is a chance for a new beginning, but we will be watching closely. 
Very well, we will tentatively accept this truce, Hades. But at the first sign of treachery, our alliance will end this ceasefire swiftly. I would expect nothing less. Thank you for this opportunity to mend old wounds. Remember, silence is key. We take them out quietly. Got it. I will follow your lead. This way. The less noise, the better. This place is a maze. Keep an eye out for patrols. That was close. We need to keep moving. There. The room should be just ahead. Let's wrap this up. The less time we spend here, the better. What disturbance mars the peace of my sanctuary? Surprise! Surprise! Release me. Do you not know who I am? We know exactly who you are, Aphrodite. And that's precisely why you're coming with us. Behold the might of love. So beautiful. Why do my powers not affect you? Hades's magic shields me. Your seduction is futile. Snap out of it. We have what we came for. Sorry, boss. For the sake of our island, let's hope this truce holds. We'll be watching, Hades. Any sign of treachery and this truce is over. Remember, peace is fragile. Handle it with care. Fools. All of them. They think they've secured peace, but they've only given me the opening I need. With the gods distracted, I can enact the next phase of my plan. Soon, the whole island will be under my control, piece by piece. You're about to play a pivotal role in our grand design. Your affection for Midas here will be instrumental. Just think of it as a new adventure, one where we get to be close. Close? With Midas? More than close. You'll see him as your heart's true desire. Midas, my dear Midas. That's right, Aphrodite. It's me, your devoted Midas. Oh, Midas, how I've longed for this moment. To be by your side is all I desire. Excellent. Now, Midas, with Aphrodite's affection, you'll have an insider among the gods. Use it wisely. I understand. We'll begin our courtship then? Yes, my love. Let's not waste a single precious moment. With every piece in place, the board is set. Now, let the game truly begin. What happened here? Speak. My Lord Zeus. It was an attack. Two intruders. They took Aphrodite. Took Aphrodite. How did this happen under our watch? They were like shadows, my Lord. Striking swiftly. We couldn't stop them. Hades, this reeks of his treachery. He orchestrated the truce to catch us off guard. We must act, my lord, before they harm Lady Aphrodite. Rally the guards. We must prepare to strike back. Hades will pay dearly for this affront. We will rescue Aphrodite and bring these deceivers to justice.
What's all this commotion about? You're here. You're safe. We thought you were taken. Taken? No, I was merely out with some acquaintances. Why? What's happened? My lady, those were not mere acquaintances. We were led to believe they abducted you. Oh, you mean Midas and his friend? They're harmless. We were just having a bit of fun trying to get me out of the castle for a while. Midas? Why does that name stir concern within me? Oh, Midas is just someone special I've recently met. In fact, I was hoping to introduce him to you as my boyfriend. Boyfriend? This is the first I'm hearing of it, and under such peculiar circumstances... I know. It's all been a whirlwind. But don't worry, you'll like him. He's quite charming. Very well, if he has your affection. We shall meet him. But stay vigilant, my dear. Not all that glitters in this world is gold. Of course, Zeus. You'll see. Everything's just perfect. Your mission is clear, Groot. Eliminate the guards. Find Midas and bring him down. Do not fail. I won't fail. Watch me end his tyranny. Hey, you. Go check out the new Candy vs. Fruit game and see if you can top the leaderboard. The code is on the screen now. What the? Hey, you shouldn't be here. I'm exactly where I need to be. We have an intruder. I need... Two more, Groot. They're coming in fast. Prepare to engage. He took down the others. Watch your back. Let's take him together. On three. Stay down, good doggy. Ah, my own creation come to haunt me. You've come a long way, Groot, but remember, it was I who made you strong. You made me a weapon. Now, I choose my own targets. And yet, here you are, doing someone else's bidding. Are you truly free, Groot, or just serving a new master? You'll always be my greatest achievement, Groot. Remember that. I'll find you, Midas, and I'll have my vengeance. Groot, this looks bad. Our backs are against the wall. We've been in tough spots before, Drax. But you're right. This one's looking particularly grim. Drax, Groot, your little rebellion ends within these walls. It's time to meet your fate. We're not the praying kind, Midas. We'll make our stand right here. And we won't be making it easy for you. You'll have to earn every inch of this victory, Midas. Let's remind Midas why he feared us in the first place. Drax, you've been more than a friend. You've been a brother. It's time for you to go. Save yourself. I'm not leaving you, Groot. We fight together no matter what. Then cover me. I have a plan. Foolish Groot, you dare challenge me alone? Groot, no! This isn't over, Midas. I will avenge Groot. You have my word. So this is the might of the Guardians of the Galaxy? Pathetic. This will serve as a perfect reminder of my strength. I saw everything, Midas. You were magnificent. The way you dispatched Groot. It was masterful. Of course it was. I'm always one stick ahead. If I may suggest, why not use these remains to your advantage? Plant them. Grow your own Groot. A Groot of my own, you say? Interesting. Yes, a Groot that serves me could be quite useful. Exactly. Imagine having a spy or a soldier that is loyal to you alone. No one would see it coming. A spy, a soldier, or perhaps a symbol of my victory over the Guardians. 
Yes, Brutus, we'll plant this and see what grows. A Groot loyal to me will be the ultimate weapon. Behold, Brutus, the fruit of our endeavors. From the remnants of defeat, we've cultivated a new ally. He's perfect, Midas. Unassuming, yet with the potential for so much more. We'll mold him into a warrior, one unlike any other. Exactly. By the time he reaches his teenage years, he'll be more than just a warrior. He'll be a covert agent, our eyes and ears within the ranks of our enemies. And the best part? No one will suspect a thing. After all, who would fear a Groot? You, my young friend, will be the key to our victory. Your training begins now, and with it, the foundation of your destiny. Then let's not waste any time. The sooner he's trained, the sooner we can execute our plan. Yes. Let the training commence. Our future victory rests on your slender branches, young Groot. Like this, Groot. Fluidity and strength. You need to be as silent as the wind and as deadly as the storm. That's it. Your punches need to hit like thunder. Remember, you're not just fighting, you're outsmarting your opponent. I will fight evil, Midas. I'll use my strength to protect and serve. Thank you for giving me this purpose. You're doing marvelously, Groot. And now, you're ready for your first real mission. Your mission is to gather intelligence on Zeus. Find out his plans, his strategies. We need to know what he intends to do next. I understand. I'll find out everything I can. Zeus won't even know I'm there. Remember, stealth is key. Use what we've taught you, and you'll succeed. I won't let you down. For justice, for peace, I'll do what must be done. I'll find out what Zeus is planning. I won't fail. We must remain vigilant, Aphrodite. Midas's influence is growing and his intentions are far from benign. His actions threaten the balance of the island. We can't let his evil spread unchecked. How dare they speak of Midas that way? I must protect his name. Enough. We will not be attacked in our own home. Who is this young creature? And why does he fight for Midas? I'm not sure, but it's clear he's been misled. We need to understand why he's so devoted to Midas's cause. What happened? Why am I here? You attacked us, under the mistaken belief that we were your enemies. But we hold no ill will towards you. We want to understand. Why did you come here to fight us on behalf of Midas? Midas raised me. He told me I was fighting for justice, to combat evil. I thought I was doing the right thing. Midas has deceived you, Groot. He is not the benevolent figure you believe him to be. Midas is responsible for much darkness in our world, including the demises of your father. My father, but... I thought I was grown from a mere stick. I don't understand. Your father was a noble warrior who fought alongside me. Midas, in his quest for power, took his life. The stick you were grown from, it was part of your father. This changes everything. I must avenge my father. I must stop Midas. Will you help me? We will, Groot, and we welcome your strength in our fight against evil. Together, we can end Midas's tyranny. For my father? For justice, I will fight. And we will be by your side every step of the way. What the? Hey, you shouldn't be here. I'm exactly where I need to be. We have an intruder. I need... Two more, Groot. They're coming in fast. Prepare to engage. He took down the others. Watch your back. Let's take him together. On three. Stay down, good doggy. Ah, oh, my 
my own creation come to haunt me. You've come a long way, Groot, but remember, it was I who made you strong. You made me a weapon. Now, I choose my own targets. And yet, here you are, doing someone else's bidding. Are you truly free, Groot, or just serving a new master? You will always be my greatest achievement, Groot. Remember that. I'll find you, Midas, and I'll have my vengeance. All I wanted was to play Candy vs. Fruit, the game from Seasons with the code below. But now I have to deal with this nonsense. Where is he? No one treats me like that without facing Olympus's wrath. Well, if it isn't the goddess of love, didn't expect you to crash this party. I'm not just a pretty face, I'm an Olympian warrior. Could have fooled me with all those love songs and poems. Swim back to Hades and tell him he's next. Midas, how do you always manage to look so... composed? Aphrodite, even in the heat of battle, one must maintain a certain... allure. After all, you never know who might board your yacht. I came here furious, ready to... and now, seeing you, I... It's okay. We've been through a lot, haven't we? Can't we put the past behind us? This isn't just about the past. You've caused chaos, not just in my world, but in... And I regret it, truly. If I could turn back time, if I could undo the pain I've caused... I want to believe you. I really do. Let's create a future where we're not defined by our past mistakes. Maybe there's a chance for us after all. You must be Aphrodite. I'm Marigold, this yacht's namesake, and more importantly, Midas's daughter. Marigold, what a lovely name. Yes, I'm Aphrodite. Your father and I were just catching up. Dad, are you sure it's wise to mingle with Olympians again? Especially after everything? It's all right, Marigold. Aphrodite and I have a complex history, but we're starting anew, right? Well, I'll be keeping an eye out. Dad's been through enough without inviting more drama. Don't worry, Marigold. I have no intention of causing any trouble. I'll be inside. Remember what I said, Dad. That's my girl, fiercely loyal and protective. Anyway, about that date. Yes, I'd like that. Let's meet later. Away from prying eyes and protective daughters. It's a date then. Until tonight, Aphrodite. There you are. I've been waiting. We need to talk about Aphrodite. Tell me about it. After the thrashing she gave me, I'm all ears for any plan against her. She's bewitched my father, and I won't stand by while she weaves her web around him. We need to act, and fast. Even goddesses have weaknesses. We find hers, exploit it, and make sure she can no longer interfere in your father's life, or mine. Exactly. I'll keep an eye on her, learn her routines, her likes, her dislikes. Knowledge will be our weapon. And I'll gather some intel from the Underworld. There might be a few old scores that can be settled with her downfall. I'm really looking forward to this evening with Midas, but I can't shake the feeling that Marigold might try to interfere. Marigold is quite protective of her father, isn't she? But I might have a solution to keep her occupied. Oh, do tell. Why not set her up with someone else for the evening? Someone who can ensure she's too preoccupied to meddle in your affairs. Interesting. And who did you have in mind? How about Hades? He's got his own agenda, but I'm sure he wouldn't mind playing along if it means causing a bit of chaos. Hades and Marigold? That's an unusual pairing. But you're right, it might just work. And it could have the added benefit of making Midas a tad jealous. Exactly. A little jealousy never hurts. 
All right, I'll arrange it. Tonight, I'll focus on Midas and let Hades handle Marigold. What's all this? Planning a little late night hunting, are we? Oh, Artemis, we were just ensuring our defenses are in order. You know, routine checks. Exactly. Can't be too careful these days. Speaking of being careful, I've been thinking, Marigold. You've been quite isolated since you arrived. How about a change of pace? A blind date, perhaps? A blind date? Here on Olympus? Yes. There's someone who's quite eager to meet you. Very influential and, let's say, quite the catch. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to meet someone new. It does get lonely here, away from home. But our plan... It can wait, Brutus. Tonight, I'll take a break. Who knows? This might be an interesting evening after all. Wonderful. I'll make the arrangements. Trust me, you won't be disappointed. I hope you know what you're doing, Mary Gold. Tonight's the night. Aphrodite, you'll see just how much I've changed. Let's make this evening unforgettable, for all the right reasons. Well, Hades, let's see if you can impress me. Tonight might just be full of surprises. Marigold, huh? This should be interesting. Let's add a little intrigue to the night. To new beginnings and putting the past where it belongs. To a night of possibilities. Not your typical underworld fair, I admit but I thought we'd try something different. It's beautiful. Thank you, Hades. Marigold, what are you doing here? With him. Dad, I could ask you the same, and with Aphrodite, no less. Seems our little gathering has taken an unexpected turn. This evening just got a lot more interesting. You and Hades? Is this some kind of joke? I'm my own person, Dad. And you, rekindling with the goddess who... Let's not turn this into a spectacle. We're all adults, albeit immortal ones. Let's talk this through. There's clearly more at play here than dinner plans. You, what are your intentions with my daughter? Are you using her to get to me? Midas, your paranoia is unbecoming. Marigold and I simply share. Mutual interests. Marigold, this isn't about us. Your father and I have history, yes, but our intentions are our own. I don't trust you, Aphrodite. Your history has caused enough turmoil. I won't let you manipulate us. Your fear blinds you, Midas. Open your eyes to the real threat. Can't you see? We're not enemies. Our fates are intertwined, for better or worse. No, you're just trying to weave your influence around everyone you meet. This isn't over. Indeed, it's far from it. Let's find a path to understanding, for all our sakes. How dare you, Midas? Your deceit knows no bounds. I trusted you, I believed in us, but it was all lies, all manipulation. I don't just want you to suffer. I want to erase your very essence from this world. Love's curse is its intensity, both in adoration and in wrath. You will rue the day you chose to deceive a goddess of passion. Aphrodite, please, let's talk about this. I know I made mistakes, but my love for you is real. We can start over. Mend what's broken. Start over? After your deceit, you played with my heart. 
There's no love left here. Only ashes. She's not holding back. Should I... No, Brutus. Put the gun down. We will not fight her. I... I can't hurt her. This isn't you, Aphrodite. Anger has clouded your judgment. I know I've wronged you, but there's still a chance for redemption. For both of us. Redemption? Your words are as hollow as your promises. You'll never deceive me again. I'll do whatever it takes to earn her forgiveness, even if it costs me everything. I want you to feel the pain you've caused me. I want you gone. Brutus, we need to leave now. This yacht won't hold much longer. I'm not gonna let her destroy everything we've built. She needs to be stopped. No, Brutus, don't. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean... I'll get you out of here. Could I have been wrong? Was there truth in his heart after all? Hades. Help him, please. I shot him by mistake during the chaos with Aphrodite. Oh, Brutus. How clumsy of you to shoot your own ally. Let's see what I can do. You tried to kill Aphrodite and shot me instead? What were you thinking? I'm sorry, Midas. It was all happening so fast. I... I was trying to protect our interests. Please forgive me. Thank you for saving me. Aphrodite. She's more dangerous than I realized. Forget about her, Midas. She's a distraction. We have bigger concerns. Dethroning Zeus. Focus on that. You're right. It's time to concentrate on the real battle. Zeus won't see us coming. How can I reach you, Aphrodite? To show you my heart, to seek your forgiveness. But you despise me, and rightly so. You summon me, Midas. What are your commands? Cerberus, I have a task for you. One of great importance and risk. Speak, and it shall be done. I need you to infiltrate Zeus's domain. Sneak into Aphrodite's chambers and bring her to me. It's personal. That's a dangerous venture. Zeus will not take kindly to an abduction. He will retaliate. I'm aware of the risks, but I must speak with her, explain myself. It's a chance I'm willing to take for, for a chance at redemption. Very well. If it's your will, I shall carry out this mission. But we must be prepared for the consequences. Just bring her to me. Once I've had a chance to speak with her, to apologize, we can let her go. He jumped in front of the bullet for me. It makes me question everything. His actions. They seemed so genuine. Aphrodite, don't let one moment of bravery cloud your judgment. Midas has a history of deception. His motives are never clear. I know, I know his past. But what if people can change? What if his love for me is the catalyst? You can't base your feelings on a what if. Remember, he's caused so much pain, not just to you, but to others as well. You're right. I must think with my head, not just my heart, but it's hard. There's a part of me that still cares for him. It's okay to care, but don't let that care lead you back into turmoil. You deserve someone who's honest and true from the start. Perhaps you're right. It's time I moved on, closed this chapter. But deep down, I'll always harbor a sliver of love for him, even if we're worlds apart. Tomorrow's a new day, and I'll face it with a clear mind. Thank you, Hope, for everything. Another quiet night. I swear, the most exciting thing around here is when the cook burns the toast. Easy does it. Midas wasn't exaggerating when he said this would be a simple task. There 
she is, the goddess of love herself, blissfully unaware of her fate tonight. Forgive me, goddess, but orders are orders. Midas needs this conversation with you. Where, where am I? What has happened? Aphrodite, my dear, you're safe. I brought you here because, because I needed to see you, to tell you how much I love you. Safe? You call being kidnapped and locked in a cell safe? Midas, have you lost your mind? Bringing me flowers in a place like this? I know it seems extreme, but I had no other way. I couldn't get close to you, and I needed you to hear me out to understand my feelings. Understand your feelings? By imprisoning me? Midas, this is madness. Your actions are unforgivable, driven by obsession, not love. I... I see now the folly of my ways. I am truly sorry. It was not my intention to scare you or cause you distress. Midas' true love does not coerce or confine. It respects, it nurtures. Aphrodite, please don't go. I love you more than anything. Can't you see the pain I'm in without you? Your pain doesn't excuse your actions, Midas. You can't just take what you want, especially not someone's freedom and or their heart. Come here to me and give me a hug. Don't you dare touch me. Your so-called love is just obsession and control. I will never be a part of your twisted world. I... I thought we could be happy together. I see now how wrong I was. Let this be the end, Midas. I want nothing to do with you. Never approach me again. Goodbye, Midas. I hope one day you'll understand the true meaning of love and respect. Ah, uh, Fortnite Island. A new playground for my amusement. This place could use a little... excitement. And I'm just the one to provide it. You there, on the ground. Enjoy your last moments of peace. I, Thanos, have chosen you to bear witness to my might. I can't wait for our camping trip. Easter break is the perfect time to disconnect and enjoy nature. Are we going to tell ghost stories around the campfire again, Dad? Of course. And this time, I've got a ghost story that will send shivers down your spine. Oh, great. So I guess I will be sleeping with you guys tonight. Just remember, we need to respect nature and not disturb the wildlife around us. Absolutely, love. We'll leave the campsite even better than we found it. It's important to teach our daughter the beauty of coexisting with nature. Do you think we'll see any shooting stars, Dad? With a sky as clear as this, I wouldn't be surprised. Make sure you have your wishes ready. What do we have here? A happy little family outing. Perfect. For my grand entrance. Hold on! You survived. Impressive, but your journey ends here, as my first experiment on this quaint little island. I will not be broken by the likes of you. My family, they are all dead. Family? No. You're about to transcend that, becoming something more or less, depending on one's perspective. What have you done to me? I've given you a gift, Drax. Or a curse. You'll be the judge in time. Now let's see what you're truly capable of.
I've roamed this island, haunted by the past. Thanos took everything from me, and I... I still haven't exacted my revenge. We understand your pain, Drax. But we haven't sensed Thanos' presence here. This island has its own dark forces at play. Groot's right. Thanos might be out of reach for now, but Hades and Cerberus? They're stirring up enough trouble right here, and they need to be stopped. Then I will join you in this fight. My battle against Thanos might be on hold, but I can still stand against evil. Protect those who cannot protect themselves. That's the spirit, Drax. Maybe our fight here will lead you back to Thanos one day. We're with you, Drax, and we'll face whatever this island throws our way. As the guardians of the galaxy. Thank you, friends. Whatever challenges await, I stand ready. For my family, for justice, I will fight until my last breath. Hades, our newest asset, Teenage Groot, is shaping up well. But there's another variable we didn't account for. Drax from the Guardians of the Galaxy is here on the island. Drax, you say? If he aligns with Zeus, that could complicate our plans. We must be prepared to counteract their moves. What was that? It came from Grim Gate. If our domain is under attack, we must respond swiftly and decisively. Is this really the best you can do? I've faced more resistance from a gnat. Come now. Surely you can do better than that. Oh wait, I can't. Ah, uh, much better. You know it's quite fitting, don't you think? A throne for a king, not some pretender to power. I suppose I should thank you, Hades, for keeping my seat warm. But don't worry, I'll take it from here. You! Off my throne! That seat is mine, and I will not tolerate this insolence. Leave now, or face the consequences. Oh, Hades, do you really think I'd vacate this comfortable position just because you asked nicely? You heard him. Get off the throne. Is that all? I expected more from the ruler of the underworld and his lackey. You dare mock us in our own domain. Listen to me, Hades. I didn't come here just to sit on your throne. I have a proposal for you. I propose an alliance. You see, I have some unfinished business with Drax and a few other so-called heroes. Together, we can crush Zeus, his allies, and anyone else who stands in our way. And what do you get out of this alliance? Satisfaction, Hades. The joy of settling old scores and establishing a new order. Together, we can rule this island and beyond. Your desire to join our cause against Hades is commendable. We can use a warrior of your caliber in this fight. I will do whatever it takes to stop Hades, but I have one condition. Once this war is over, I need your help to return to my universe. I have unfinished business with Thanos. Your quest for justice against Thanos is something we respect. You have our word, Drax. Once Hades is dealt with, we will assist you in your journey back. Thank you. That means more to me than you can imagine. For now, let's focus on the task at hand. Hades' reign and machinations must come to an end. With your help, I believe we can achieve victory. Then let's prepare for war. I'm ready to fight alongside you and put an end to Hades' tyranny. Together, we will safeguard this island and ensure peace reigns once more. Your bravery will not be forgotten. We are united in this cause. You are not alone in your fight, Drax. The day is nearing, Thanos. Your shadow has loomed over me for too long. Here, on this island, I will end our dance of vengeance. I will have my retribution. I couldn't help but overhear. Your thirst for justice against Thanos it resonates with us, Drax. Aphrodite, 
I am committed to this fight, to stopping Thanos and avenging my family. But he's cunning and powerful. How do we draw him out? We have devised a strategy. We offer Thanos a seat among the gods, an offer we know will intrigue him. And when he comes to claim it, we'll be ready to ambush him. A deceitful tactic, but against Thanos, all measures are justified. I will stand with you, with all my might and every ally I can muster. Together, we will create a trap that even Thanos cannot escape. Your strength and resolve will be crucial when the time comes. Then let the trap be set. I'll rally every friend, every ally I've made on this island. We will be the anvil upon which Thanos' fate is sealed. That was cool. Not nearly as cool as Candy vs. Fruit, though. The game from Seasons? The code is on screen. Behold, mortals. Ares, the god of war, has descended upon your quaint little island. Welcome to the island, Ares. I'm Jonesy, and this is Peely. We're big fans of your work. Hey, maybe you can join our squad. I am a lone warrior, a deity of destruction. Right, right, lone warrior. But, you know, even warriors need friends. We could grab some slurp juice, talk strategy, or just hang... Always missing the point. Let the true battle begin. These islanders will learn the meaning of war. Ares, god of war, I challenge you. Defeating you will bring me eternal glory. A mortal challenging a god. Amusing. Show me your valor, then. Is this all the might you possess? I expected more from one so audacious. Midas! Run, little boy, and tell tales of Ares' invincibility. You truly are a god of war. Remember this day, mortal. Tell your people of the folly of challenging divinity. Brutus, what audacity brings you here unannounced? Speak quickly. Great Zeus! I come with urgent news! Ares has arrived on the island. He... He bested Midas in combat, showcasing fearsome strength. Ares? Here? That sounds serious. Ares, the god of war. Oh, Brutus, your tale does amuse me. Ares has no business here, nor does he know our ways. No, you must believe me. He's not just here. He's a force unlike any we've encountered. Midas was left in defeat. Midas defeated. Very well, Brutus. We shall take your warning under advisement. But remember, this is Olympus. Ares or any other deity would be wise to tread carefully. Thank you, mighty Zeus. I only wish to avert a crisis before it unfolds. Guardian of the Gate. I was hoping for a challenge, but I suppose you'll have to do. Ares, you dare to challenge me at my post? I will defend this gate with my last breath. Let's see if you're as tough as you look, or if you're just a big puppy at heart. Fetch, mighty Guardian! Again. Again. Please throw it again. I'm a good boy. That's a good boy, Cerberus. Who knew the fearsome guardian could be tamed with a simple game? Well, this was easier than expected. Stand down, Cerberus. You've proven your worth. Not as a guardian, but as a loyal beast. Incredible. Ares, my own nephew, taming Cerberus with such ease. This is no trivial display of power. If Ares can bend Cerberus to his will, what's to stop him from turning the rest of us into his playthings? This 
this changes everything. Alliances. Yes, that's what we need. Even gods must unite when faced with such a formidable foe. But who to trust? Who to bring into the fold? Ares may be powerful, but he's not invincible. We need a plan. A coalition of deities and heroes to counter his might. It's time to put aside old grievances and forge new bonds. Midas, we need to talk. Your encounter with Ares has shown us just how formidable he truly is. Hades, unless you've come with a miracle cure for my injuries, I'm not sure how much help I can be in your grand plans. This is bigger than just you or me, Midas. Ares is a threat to all of us. I'm proposing an alliance. An alliance? Look at me, Hades. I'm hardly in fighting shape. And after what Ares did, you really think I'm eager to jump back into the fray? I understand your hesitation. But this isn't just about facing Ares in direct combat. We need your strategic mind. Your resources. My strategic mind didn't help much last time, did it? I'm sorry, Hades, but I'm out. This god of war you're so concerned about, let him come. I'm done playing hero. Don't let fear dictate your actions. We can overcome Ares together. Your courage once inspired many. Don't let that be a tale of the past. Courage? That was pride. And look where it got me. No, I think I'll sit this one out. Watch from the sidelines. Medusa, I require your unique talents. Ares has become a threat to us all, and I'm gathering forces to... Ares? The Ares is here? On our island? Oh, tell me everything. Is he as handsome as the legends say? Yes. Well, his appearance is not the issue here. We need to unite, and... Unite with Ares, you say? Oh, what a splendid idea. Imagine me and Ares together. Do you think he'd find me attractive? I just got my hair done, uh. Medusa, we're talking about a war, not Tinder. Ares is dangerous, and- Oh, pish posh. Love is a battlefield, isn't it? And what better way to win a war than with a little romance? Please, Hades, tell Ares I'm his biggest admirer. Very well, Medusa. I'll mention you to Ares. But in return, I need your commitment to our cause. Brother Zeus, I come not as a foe, but seeking an alliance. It pains me to say it, but we face a common enemy. An alliance with you, Hades, the world must be ending. What threat looms so large that you darken my doorstep with your presence? It's Ares. He's grown too powerful, too unpredictable. His actions threaten us all, and I believe only by joining forces can we hope to stop him. Ares? My heart aches to hear he's causing such turmoil. What has he done, Hades? He's turned Cerberus into a puppy, for starters. His influence spreads like a plague, and if left unchecked, there's no telling what havoc he will wreak. An alliance then, but mark my words, Hades, once this threat is neutralized, our truce ends. Agreed. I have no love for permanent alliances, but together, we can turn the tide against Ares. Looks like Ares isn't going to make this easy for us. Let's remind these minions whom they're dealing with. For Ares, attack! You face the king of the gods, your master's stronghold will fall. Your loyalty to Ares is misguided. Surrender now, and we might spare you. It seems Ares has been busy recruiting. These guards are relentless. Their resolve is commendable, but futile. No mere soldier can stand against us. The guards are defeated. Now for Ares himself. He was right here. Where has he gone? 
Ares is cunning. He wouldn't fall so easily. This disappearance. It's another one of his tricks. He may have escaped this time, but Ares cannot hide forever. We must remain vigilant. His vanishing act only delays the inevitable. When he resurfaces, we'll be ready to end this. We must strengthen our defenses, alert our allies. Ares' next move will be desperate and dangerous. Agreed. Let's prepare. The next time he shows himself, we will finish what we started here today. Thank you.